Hey there everyone, this is MarkyMan64 here welcoming you back to another episode of Let's Play LEGO Jurassic World on the PS4. This is episode number 16. So in the previous episode we had a revelation. We found out that the Indominus Rex, the, the large T-Rex-like creature that has escaped from its pen is actually also part Velociraptor. So yeah, not only is it is it part T-Rex, we've now found out that it's part Velociraptor and it's taken charge of the pack of Velociraptors that Owen here has been training since their birth. So that that doesn't sound like a good a good selection or collection of events to happen. But anyway, we're going to continue with the story in here and it's Main Street Showdown. That sounds ominous. And this kind of cage looking thing. This is the visitor center. They evacuated the lab. Where's Henry? Dr. Wu works for us. That's not a real dinosaur. No, it ain't, kid. Imagine that one. A fraction of its size. Intelligent, deadly, able to hide from military technology. <gasps> Easy, boy. We're on, we're, on, we're on the same side, right? This way! Okay, so what is it with the finales of these games? being um, in visitor centers, and again, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to whisper. Um, is she, no, so she is not a, a you know, a, a, an employee of InGen like the classic InGen. I suppose she's an, an employee of InGen, like the modern company, but she's not able to get through that. And are we not able to do something here? Holoscape. Well, we've just destroyed that. So we are in the visitor center, uh, the the new visitor center. Oh, there's uh, Mr. Hammond there. Let's this hit hit this hit this statue. Okay, that's what we think of him. <laughs> he didn't make his his opinions clearer. Uh, so she's able to activate this, isn't she? Triangle square. Uh, triangle X. A square that was right. <laughs> um, so this is a mini kit, and so this is this seems like a, a um, worthy worthy use of our time. <laughs> while while the Velociraptors are up there hunting for us, and it is is quite it's quite funny in the in the movie. Um, I've actually I uh, with um. With my notes, I've got the names of, of important people, and uh, with Hoskins uh, in brackets afterwards, I've got armless, as in harmless, but like, if you've watched the movie, you know, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> so, do we need to activate? Oh, thank you, Jimmy Fallon. Uh, that is, that is... Legendary comedian and night 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 show, e e evening show. What's it What's it called again? <laughs> that type of show, late night show, late night show host. Um, Jimmy Fallon, who, who makes a guest appearance in, in the movie. <laughs> okay, what what? Oh yeah, okay. She's she's activating this. 
can climb up to it here. Yeah, go on, Owen. You climb up to it there. <laughs> so what? What is he doing? What are we aiming to do here? What? Why is he climbing? All right, okay. So that he can get up to the top floor. I'm guessing he, he was well, not now. But are we going to get Grey? Yes, well done, Grey. And we can use the bones to get up there. So then. All right, okay, so it's just nice replacing. Work, yeah, the Gray's not going up there first, is he? <laughs> Owen, Owen can go up there first. He's been training them for years. So I can't, can't do anything with that. Can't do anything here. But still, obviously, collecting as many studs as possible. Is this a, a DNA chain? Can I not destroy that? No. Uh, so I need to switch to clear in a few seconds after I've <laughs> after I've satisfied my my need to destroy as many things as possible. It's kind of half. Yeah, it is. It is just a, a habit because I don't need to do that. I suppose. Well, I, soon I will have the the red brick, the the at least one multiplier. Well, have one multiplier because I can't afford any more than that. But um, I'm not gonna have to pay for that, am I? I think I think what I'm going to do is get the times two multiplier and then like a few more red bricks because I think I'm going to be able to afford a few more red bricks once I find them. And so like I'll get as many that I can that that will help me get studs like the stud magna and. And things like that, and maybe things to help the rest of the game. Okay, yeah. So we need to get Gray to go in here. <laughs> like they're, they're terrified animation. So the Velociraptors have destroyed. Have destroyed this this walkway thing that that we need to use, so we're not able to go down there. Oh, he's walking really slowly. <laughs> okay, so I want to destroy this priceless skeleton. Um, I was I went to to London. In a uh, November of of last year, um, just at the end of of last year, uh, and they have the the Natural History Museum, which I went to, and it has a, a you know it has some cool dinosaur bones and and things like that. It's, it's quite fascinating. So. Why did I do that? What was the advantage of doing that? Yeah, nice work, kid. Okay, okay, so Owen needs to go through and make himself invisible. Again, you know, he's, he's invisible to these velociraptors? Sure. <laughs> oh, so they're still able to get through. Okay, so I need to... Yeah, so they, they they were able to get past them. It, it just needed to be away from there, and he's just kept. Oh, okay, I got a, a little fright there. He's just kept this torch in his back pocket, then, yeah, <laughs> just in case. <laughs> and it's still still lasting, <laughs> still lasting. Camera wonkiness. And then where did it go? <laughs> where is it? <laughs> That's even more freaky than uh, <laughs> jumping out at me, the fact that it disappears. <laughs> so what's that going to power? Alright, okay, so this is going to distract, distract the Velociraptor. Jimmy Fallon just popping up. <laughs> I love how, you know, it is obviously, like, it, he plays himself in the movie, but like... It's just, it's just Jimmy Fallon. 
<laughs> like popping up. <laughs> is he is he the first real person to be in one of these games? Like not not ironically, but like like it is him <laughs> in in the movie. <laughs> okay, so I needed to get get rid of that that Velociraptor so that I could come down here. <laughs> you saw Echo behind the door uh, a few seconds ago, like just it looked like they were just standing there. And there is a really helpful, a really helpful board for for me. I, and yeah, I could have like looked at this and examined it before I started this let's play. <laughs> Ankylo, Ankylosaurus, uh, Brachiosaurus. Yeah, I forgot the Ankylosaurus's name. Um, and again, that that's in the description. If you if you look at the description, I sometimes put things that I forgot to say, or or not forgot to say, but I didn't know to say often, um, more than more than me forgetting to say something. <laughs> Does it not see that the that, that can just mysteriously moved away? So I'm obviously going to need to get Zach to repair, repair that board thing. Is he able? Yeah, to take this off now. And I presumably need to create some sort of distraction for. Is it is it Echo that I'm trying to distract? So. What is this going to do? Is it going to fire something over there? I hope you like playing or pizza, right? Oh, it kind of broke apart the pizza. So then, Zach is going to be able to fix this. Of course you can, Zach. I still can't understand that being a thing. Like Zach being able to repair things. <laughs> Feels like they would chomp at that a little bit and then realise that it's not real. Not necessarily understand why it's not real, but realise it's not real and then stop trying to chomp at it. But anyway. This is how it is, huh? Easy. E easy. Easy. Seventy-four, fifty-eight times two, one hundred ninety. We need more. What? Teeth. We need more teeth. Larry, are you still there? I need you to open paddock nine. Nine? Are you kidding? Yeah, so the, the best way, in case you don't know or in case you're ever in this situation, the best way to um, get get rid of a problem dinosaur is by releasing as many dinosaurs as you possibly can. <laughs> because as Grey points out, we, we don't have enough teeth. Um, which is a really weird way of describing what he's, what he's actually meaning. He, he means like we need another dinosaur to like make up the the difference in the number of teeth in <laughs> comparison. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, anyway, with to be with to be blue and while while the other dinosaurs uh, while the other velociraptors I should maybe say um, are distracting the uh, the the Indominus Rex. We have to do something. So that turns on these lights, and so yeah, the blue is now just a friend again. They don't really explain that in the movie, but I suppose like you know you 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 have your loyalties and stuff, and then like it's, it reminds it reminded them. That, that you 
that they, they had to they had to follow him. <laughs> I suppose is, is where we're going with that. So anyway, so they they are distracting the the Dominus Rex just now and Claire has went away to do something about the number of teeth. Um sure. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go with that. So it destroyed the, the amber statue and I don't remember what what I meant to do. Oh, am I meant to do something with this? Okay, I don't quite know what that does but yeah okay so blue is going to follow the scent. <laughs> It's such a like silly, silly movie and silly that that it works as well. Like, okay, you might have the idea, but the fact that it then works is like is ridiculous. <laughs> so blue is going to put that together, and then he, 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 she, not he, she is going to uh, need to swap with somebody, and is grey now stuck here. No, okay, Grey needs to Grey needs to be the one to go up there. Um okay. Switch to Grey. And then Grey is going to take another picture. And let me just check, is that has that removed hearts from the Indominus Rex? No, it hasn't. Okay. I was going to say, because I think it has removed hearts before, right? Uh, depending on what you're doing, but like it's it's silly that that would be a heart reducing uh, thing. So what what am I going to do here? Okay, so there's electricity on both sides, so I'm not going to be able to do anything just now, and I'm going to need to switch to one of these guys. And what are they going to do? Just, just fight it. Okay, so that's d different than different than how they've done it before. What, what am I doing here? Oh, okay, okay. So if I get these three, am I going to get a mini kit? Yeah, that's cool. So then fire in its mouth, and then. I think I'm going to be able to climb up there. I think um, it's able to, yeah, snatch at the Indominus Rex's mouth, obviously. <laughs> so this is soft toys that I'm I'm putting it into into its mouth here, and then I'm going to need to switch back to. It's going to destroy this. The, the weapon thing um, and it's an unnatural thing to, to press the circle button for that but that's what I need to press and how many hearts has he got left? Less than less than me. Uh, yeah I thought it was going to destroy that but then alright okay it's just going to come back fair enough so then B is this, is this Delta that I am just now? Yeah, that didn't look very painful, but oh well. So yeah, now we have the T-Rex. So again, how, how to how to defeat a uh, a dinosaur that is that is uncontrollable is to apparently have some dinosaurs that are controllable, but you know one massive one that is that has previously been seen to be completely uncontrollable. 
Sure. <laughs> Okay, what did that? Oh yeah, okay, so he's able to grab this. So what is this going to be able to do? I thought they were people in there, but <laughs> I can see that they're mannequins. Uh, Blue is going to be able to build a ladder? Yeah, okay. <laughs> it was a bit confusing because it was like building it <laughs> and I'm, I'm still gathering all this stuff. This this has been like a uh, one of those levels that you're like really? <laughs> like but it does happen in the movie. Not exactly like this but yeah it just it's such a big not plot hole but like why on earth would that be uh, an advantage to release the T-Rex, <laughs> the one that's caused them all this trouble in the past. <laughs> why, why would they then go, oh yeah, like that, that seems like the best, the best plan <laughs> is to release, to release the T-Rex. It's got, it's got teeth, <laughs> it's got enough teeth. So it's, no, no, I didn't want to do that, I wanted to switch. Who, where's where's Owen now? <laughs> where's Owen went? <laughs> okay, there he is. Uh, but we can switch to him any time by doing that. So wh where did we want this again? Oh yeah, okay, it was up there. I was sure that it was there was something down there that I needed to use. Okay, fair enough. So then, do I need to be clear? I need to be clear. No, I don't. Okay, she's just gonna go up there herself. Okay. So then do I need to be clear? I think I need to be clear now. Because uh, the, the computer version of clear is just too silly to, to figure it out herself. <laughs> okay. So yeah, sure. <laughs> I don't know why I'm like, like you know, suspending disbelief. <laughs> You don't need to suspend disbelief like any, like much more in this movie to, you know, to, to reach, to reach where you're at. I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> I've just went, went giddy with the, with the silliness of, of this, of this scene in the movie. <laughs> Alright, okay. He's being sarcastic. Good. <laughs> okay. Go up, yeah. Wait down. You're like you, you, the others can't get up here. Okay, so he's gonna cut some rope or something. <laughs> you're such a mess. Like why? Why would you? Yeah, that was quite satisfying actually. Um, why would you go for the the T Rex? Like they've already established that it's it's better, in in a lot of ways to the the T Rex. Like the T Rex is the base. Of of the Indominus Rex, and so they've established that, like, you know, it's it's taken things like, you know, the the well, the short arms are are quite famous, obviously, in the T Rex, but it's taken them, and okay, so is it are they not? Okay, what what? Why did I need to switch to switch to them? Because they're not able to do anything. Alright, okay. So then what what do we do? Alright, okay, the 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 other one's able to grab onto this, right? Right? Yeah, there we go. Alright, okay, it's gonna it's gonna be able to jump on the Indominus Rex, I think. Yeah, suddenly they're too scared to get too close. But now they're not. Yeah, like again, like... I don't think this is a, a very fair fight. I know that it's... They're obviously... It's obviously not just the T-Rex versus the Indominus Rex. Like this kind of exaggerates that point. Like in the movie, it is very much like a, a tag team.
but I don't think that would exist in the, the real world either. I, th I don't think it would. the T-Rex would go, oh yeah, we've, we've got to get help from these Velociraptors here. Oh, Indominus Rex. Oh. <laughs> There's always a bigger, badder dinosaur. In this case. <laughs> Okay, there we go. Story complete for Jurassic World, and that is the the story complete for the the whole game. So that's that's quite quite cool that we were on episode sixteen and we've we've finished the story mode for the for the entirety. Uh, so it's seventy six percent. So we weren't all that close, but that that is unlikely to be as much of an issue going forward just saying. So we have unlocked the survivor versions of the characters now as well. So you can you can switch between um, you can choose whoever you want, especially in free play mode. You'll see that. Quite interesting that they've got all the, the little characters down where Grey is, like separate from other people. Yeah, and there's there's like some behind the scenes people and I think this is unlocked. Yeah, there's like Steven Spielberg, uh, for uh, example, who I, I don't think is in the movie, right? But like he's in the the kind of opening when you're when you're loading a game. He's he's in that scene that is playing out. So we've got thirty one of, what was it, 275 or something? So let's finish story. Is there a cutscene? I can't remember. Yes, there is. Where's Hoskins? He didn't make it. But he left provisions? Our deal is still intact? Don't worry. You'll be well taken care of. Okay, so then we are the Indominus Rex chasing what looks like, it looks like blue, right? Um, and we are going to, or I'm going to skip ahead in the video, but actually be collecting as many studs here as possible. Again, I, I'm going to like uh, throw the, the number of studs out the park very soon, but hey. Uh, a few more studs can never hurt. Um, but I'm going to skip ahead to that, and so join me in a second. So there we go, so 28.7%. And that was a, a good little haul of studs there. Okay, I don't don't quite know what that was what that was about. To be honest with you, <laughs> maybe there was some sort of uh, in joke story to that. I had no idea. But anyway, so we are back here again, and I I thought it was I thought it was daytime here. Can you can you change the the time of day? Um. Anyway, so. 
I am going to view map. I think. Can you can you teleport? I don't I don't remember whether you can teleport or not. But if you can't, then then I'm going to uh, figure out a way to map point travel to area. Okay, so I can travel to there. Can I travel over here? Travel to area, yes. And the daytime. Okay, so you can you can travel to different places and it's going to load up the visitor center from Jurassic Park. In theory, yes it is. Okay, so what I'm going to want to do because I've been talking about it so much, is I'm going to go around here, don't collect anything just yet, or I can collect some studs I suppose coming around here, but there's no point in collecting too many studs from objects just now, because I am going to become, where is he, is this him? Barry. I'm going to become Barry. And he is going to shoot at this target and hopefully we are going to get something really cool once I am a character that can go into the dark. So who can go into the dark? Can um, Where is he? he? He can go. Ian Malcolm can go into the dark. And so what, what treasure is in here? Yes, that is right. It's a red brick. Which red brick? I wonder. Uh, we will find out when we go into the visitor center. So once you collect red bricks, you can then go into the visitor centers either here um, uh, on in Jurassic Park or into the visitor center at Jurassic World. And yeah, this is where we were meant to be in a few episodes ago. And you know, looking at it now, I don't really see it. Like, the, there was the bone entrance here um, in the Jurassic World version, and then there was, like, trees over here, but, like, there's clearly not trees over here. So, yeah, so I've still not decided properly what I'm going to do about, like, uh, whether I'm going to have uh, the commentary or how I'm going to arrange that but yes so we have the score times two red brick which is a million studs and that's us spent a million and we now have a uh, 881,430 um, remaining and we need to we need two million to get the times four and then times six is three million times eight is four million times ten is five million so by the time we get to and then there's other ones which we will get. I, I want to get them quite soon, but obviously I want to get the multipliers as well. Uh, so we might need to like do some stud farming, uh, which I will show you just now. If we activate that by going to extras and t times to turn it on because it's off by default. I know that we can like type in codes and unlock it that way, but now we are going to collect studs so much quicker. It's hard to tell with, uh, yeah, there's a blue stud. So that's boosted it up by quite a lot. And then also over here is a room that opens up for us. And this room has quite a few studs in it as well. There's also, um, there's, a, there's a few places that there are quite a few studs, but then there's a few kind of bonus levels where studs are more plentiful. And so I will be using them mainly to be able to afford certainly the times two, as I've said before, I just killed that guy. As I said before, um, once you get the times four, it's a lot easier to get the others because they, they get progressively easier even though they're more more money and uh, they get progressively easier um, as as they go along 
especially after the times four. So I thought there was like a, a oh is it behind this table? Yeah, there's like a, a bunch of them. What what is this again? Oh, this is to to make custom dinosaurs, which I don't think I'm gonna really bother with. That's a different type of door than the other side. That's that's a bit weird. But yeah, so now I am free to to wander about the park. Not that I wasn't able to before, but I'm now able to wander about the park and get pretty much everything. So if we can get um where where is he? I want to switch to Paul Kirby. Um if if only this was in alphabetical order rather than importance order, then it, it might be might be easier to, to get things, but anyway, so I am now free to get things and I will be getting things. As I said, I don't quite know yet um what I'm gonna do about commentaries and like whether I'm going to why is he not like on this? And that, like, yeah, that's a bit weird, but he, he wasn't on it properly. Um, there. If, if he jumps from them like that, then he's going to jump to them. But he can suddenly, he can suddenly reach them. Anyway, yeah, so I saw this gold brick ages ago and said, oh yeah, we're not going to get that yet. Well, we're going to get it now. Um, and yeah, so I'm going to continue this kind of early search for things in the next episode. Um, I'm, I'm probably going to do a bit of everything for the start and I really do want to get those, uh, the, what do you call them, the, the uh, gold bricks, not gold bricks, red bricks as soon as possible because that is going to make life a lot easier because I'm going to be able to find things and like there's a stud um, attractor a, a magnet thing that's going to make that easier and especially in the the levels where you've got characters that are yeah like the, the times two is all right but it's not amazing but we're going to we're going to get there don't worry um no, he's not got a camera. Um, none of them have cameras. I'm going to need to go to... I think it's... Grey has a camera, so let's be be him. Um, oh yeah, that's, that's quite a nice one. So yeah, we're going to do that in the next episode. So join us again for another episode. That's 33 Gold Bricks. Join us again for another episode of Let's Play Lego Jurassic World on the PS4. Please like, comment, subscribe for more. Thanks everyone for watching, see you later, bye bye.